Hello everybody, my name is Raul Hernandez. I'm part of the marketing team here at Cyprus. And uh, I wanted to tell you a little bit about CY8 Kit 037 Motor Control Evaluation Kit. This kit that I have right here comes actually with this cool PMSM VLDC motor. The board has actually a lot of functionality. We have all these uh, jumpers in which you can configure it to be doing censured uh, BLDC control, FOC, uh, single shunt, sensorless, dual shunt. You can do some stepper motor control as well, all of it with this board. This board has uh, an Arduino compatible connector, so we can pretty much plug it into any of our Pioneer kits. In this case, for this particular demo, I'm gonna use our CY8 kit 042 powered by a PSEC 4 4200 part. I'm gonna go ahead and connect it. This is not the out-of-the-box demo. The out-of-the-box demo actually has a censored BLDC motor control. So we want to go to cypress.com backslash CY8CKit037 and download the kit installer. And once we install that, it's going to appear in our creator start page, like we see right here. Important to mention, once we have this, you can always have access to the full user guide, release note, and quick start guide that includes everything from schematic, board information, uh, and step-by-step -step to get the motor started. So in this case, as you can see, we have five projects that are included. We're going to do the sensorless field-oriented control. That's going to open the setup, and we're going to just go quickly into the high-level description. From a hardware perspective, we have the setup of our PWMs. We have a control register. We have uh, a clock into each of the PWMs that go into the power stage. We have a sequential SAR ADC that's doing a bunch of readings from an analog perspective. We have uh, two voltages being measured and, and amplified by an op-amp. The um, overcurrent protection that's using our internal IDAC and a comparator in order to generate an overcurrent protection interrupt. So that sets up the hardware of the system. We're gonna go ahead and build it. As you all know, filler rate control is a uh, math intensive motor control algorithm. Uh, all of it is done on the ARM M0 core for PSEC 4. Uh, and as you can see, it, it simplifies a lot of the hardware development because you're able to use our internal digital logic and analog front end to further take advantage of signals, uh, amplifications, currents, uh, and do a lot of cool things with it. The motor control library is included, as you saw, and you can access it. And here, if you go quickly into the main file, we have the start of the op-amps, the ADC, the PWMs. We start everything, and then we go into a four that's uh, doing the polling and running the IGBTs. So once we have that, we're gonna go ahead and connect the O42 board, and the motor control shield. Now it's important to mention there's a silk screen that tells us what the setup of the jumper needs to be in order to, uh, to function as a filler into control sensorless demo. And that's also included in the user guide. So make sure that you go over those. Once all of that is connected, we're gonna go ahead and program the board. And that's done. In order to get the motor started, we're gonna press the push button here and that's gonna get the ramp up of the revolution. As you can see, it's a quiet operation. It has all the field oriented control characteristics and it becomes a very easy way to get started. Now we can actually use the, the potentiometer to speed it up and slow it down. And you can also use the same push button to shut it off. As you saw, it was very easy. We have the schematic, the projects, all the board uh, software and hardware information is available. Just go to cypress.com backslash motor control or cypress.com backslash CYHCKit037 to download all of this information and uh, start playing with the development. Now, once you do that, make sure you go to cypress.com backslash projects and share with us what you do. Thanks.